What's going on you guys? Today we're gonna to be reviewing the Z Extreme. Now I actually bag an Elite X Extreme and you might have seen it in my past videos. It goes pretty straight for me but it still has that overstable finish and the great thing about the Elite X Plastic is it just dives in the ground. But I have never ever thrown an Elite Z Extreme from Discraft. Now someone told me that it's extremely overstable, the Z Plastic ones, and Honestly, this one, it has some ink on it, but it feels like it's pretty new. There's like zero marks on it. They must have hardly thrown this disc. So we're gonna get the real deal today. I'm excited to throw this. And they actually did uh, remake this disc for Ledgestone, I believe, but I don't think it was a Z plastic one. So. so I think this review will be pretty good. And we're also gonna be comparing the extreme to my Luster Whippet. If you've seen the video where I threw the Champion Viper, I believe the Whippet is actually more overstable because it has one less glide. Now, I've actually kind of used them interchangeably. This is actually kind of my backup for the Viper. I didn't really want to lose the Viper. Now I've got two of these, thankfully, but this thing is my most overstable fairway driver, and it's honestly like a mini tilt. If you've seen my tilt video, you know how crazy that disc is. But I really want to see if this extreme compares to the Whippet at all, because it is similar flight characteristics numbers-wise. Right, I'm gonna throw them both sidearm first. I'm gonna start with the Whippet because I bagged this disc. I can show you guys how it flies, and then we'll try the extreme. We'll see if there's a difference or if one's more overstable. So. Starting with the Whippet, I'm gonna go crazy Anheuser, and you're gonna see this thing just fight out. And it's a six speed, so it's not as fast as the tilt, but it's just like the tilt. I mean, I pretty much threw that on a lot of Anheuser. That was pretty decent. Oh my gosh. All right. Honestly, I couldn't really tell if that was more overstable or not. It kind of slipped out of my hand and I thought I was gonna smack that post, but it actually fought out before that. Let's go throw some backhands with it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> actually went really far. Ah, okay. Honestly, I thought the Whippet was so much farther than the Extreme because it was in the air for so long. But look, the Extreme is basically next to it. All right, not quite the same throw, but in conclusion, I gotta say that extreme is pretty extreme because the whip that I have, I'm like, you know, I don't even need a Firebird. This thing is the craziest overstable fairway that I have. But honestly, that extreme is pretty close. You know, I've always thought that the Discraft extreme is supposed to kind of be like uh, in of a whip it. Maybe it's supposed to be like a Viper. Let me know in the comments below. But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Pretty similar discs. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one.